Hey guys, Josh Sanders with Sanders Fishing. Um, just kind of wanted to give a proper intro here. Um, me and my dad have came down to Kiowa Island. Um, it's our second afternoon here. We got here Monday or yesterday. Um, caught some really good flounder yesterday. Um, some good keepers had a few over 18 inches. Um, had uh, the gnats are killing me. We're right here on the swamp. We're fishing these ponds on the island and um, you know just running the tide between ponds on the island and catching some really good reds and drums we've absolutely slayed the red drum today and flounder uh, dad just actually caught one that's probably 24 25 inches really good one um, just uh, hit that like and subscribe button this is gonna be a series of videos I'm down here for a week uh, just doing nothing but fishing um, so you know I'm probably gonna not do a ending statement with every video you know we'll start here and and at the end of the videos uh, I'll kind of make a conclusion video or something maybe but anyway catching everything on a Berkeley gulp shrimp um, you know and that's catching flounders reds you know of course we're catching croakers and pinfish stuff like that too but um, we're after reds, flounder, and sea trout. I haven't caught any sea trout yet, but this is about, you know, two, three o'clock in the afternoon uh, on our second day here. Um, I hope you guys enjoy this series of videos, and uh, thanks for watching. We just hooked a good red. <laughs> nice red. I'm on the old Berkeley Gulp Shrimp. Pretty red, big blue tail. Let's go over here and see if he's a keeper. I may have a keeper, I don't know. Huh? That's red. He crushed that shrimp. <laughs> All right, guys, I don't think he was quite a keeper. <laughs> hey, red drum's 15 inches. He was right at 15, but a little bit hairline so it's our first day here so you got this pond right here the bass pond all this water is going into this it comes in and out of this culvert pipe as you can see coming in and out of the road here just got a 3 16 ounce lead head with a berkeley gulp shrimp on it And that fish just oh gosh it was a big one oh my gosh it was a good one god that was a good one I'm just kind of dabbing this thing, man. That last one. 
I've been seeing them come up and eat it. Oh, there's some big ones in there, dude. I just seen a nice one. I'm gonna run and get dad and tell him to come over here. few fish in here. There's another one. Man, this is awesome. Bunch of 15, 14, 15 inch red drum, man, on spinning tackle. That is fun, look at the two spots on his tail. It's pretty. Pretty, pretty. We're still breaking right here. Let's see if we can't get us another one. We found a honey hole on the low tide. God, that's a nice one. Another nice red drum. My, sh my shrimp's about messed up. I might have to go get another one. Stepping over to make sure my my big red rod ain't doubled over. I can't believe I lost that one. Oh, there's one. That's a nice one, dude. That's a caper. Yeah, heck yeah. That's a good caper. They liking it high and fast. Popping it right across the top. That's a nice one. Oh yeah. That's a good one. Is that a keeper? No, I, they're they're all like fourteen or fifteen inches. Good job, man. That's awesome. They kill it, don't they? Look how pretty the spots and the blue tails on them jokers are. Oh. 
we got one on the big rod, son. Whew. Thank you. Ain't that big. I thought my rod was going in the water. <laughs> He's a pretty good one. That's a bull, he ain't no keeper. Too big? Yeah, he's way too big. <laughs> yeah, I got it. Flyers out. Well, I was trying to get him for. He started flipping out. Oh, that's a nice red. Hold him up for the camera here so everybody can see him. Nine and a half inches, not a bad one. Whoo, man! I thought my rod was going in the water on that one. I, I was all the way at the truck out there, and I seen it. I heard it screaming. I don't know where my shrimp's at. It's hung up under the dock. My shrimp, I lost my hat because the wind's blowing a hundred mile an hour. Oh. All right, I'm gonna get rigged back up here. We didn't bring the net, did we? <laughs> uh -uh. Oh, <laughs> we didn't bring the net. We switched ponds here and I can get him here. That's a nice red right there. He's probably just hooked a good flounder. Yeah, I'll get him. I'll just pull him up. Nice flounder. I don't think he's a keeper. Well, he would have been a keeper last year. He's about 15 and a quarter. He's close to being a keeper. That's what we're looking for is in flatfish. 
hopefully we can catch a keeper. They just changed the uh, limit to 16 inches in South Carolina. Dad's got a nice flounder here. Just pull him up. I think you'll be all right. Yeah, he's not a keeper, but breaking the ice. Pretty little flounder. He don't come back. Don't make Yeah, he may be a keeper. I don't know. That ain't a keeper. He's he's little. He's 14 and a half. He wouldn't have kept last year. Another 14 and a half inch flounder. There's some in here. What do you think? <laughs> they need to be a little bigger. Last year they were a little more healthy. Oh, I hooked another flounder. Another little guy, probably 12 inches. Man, we need some big ones, man. Where in the world are the big ones? They're all babies. Catching them all on the Berkeley Gulp Shrimp. 316 ounce lead head. Got a pin, spin fisher 2500. Really good reel, just got it this year. Uh, St. Croix Triumph M Shore Rod. Seven foot, medium heavy. Uh, we're gonna try to keep catching some. I don't know, maybe they'll get bigger. Tide's starting to get right and really push some current into these ponds. We got a lot of bait around us. Hopefully we can catch some. Oh gosh, don't get me around them pipes. Oh no. Oh. This is a hard spot to fish. Another nice red. Caught him over here. I stepped on the other side of the pond where the tide's starting to come in. Nice fish. Got another flounder on. I still don't think he's a keeper. Fourteen. Nice flounder though. Dad's got another flounder. Another tiny one. And about twelve inches. He put his rod down and left it there and went back and picked it up and had a fish on it. <laughs> That's a good one. Oh Lord, that's gotta be a keeper, maybe. That's gotta be a keeper, maybe. Caught him on the gulp shrimp. 
nice flounder. Oh yeah, he's 16. Oh yeah. I can't tell yet. I know I let him swallow it. Hope he don't break me off. Yeah, definitely need the net. It's a good one. Well, I don't know if he's a keeper or not. I'll just lift him up. Another good flounder. Just had something take down the big rod here. I may have jerked it out of his mouth. Got a fish, he's just swimming towards me. Oh my god, that's a flounder. A flounder on a piece of cut bait. Huh. That's crazy. That's a dang big flounder. He's definitely a good keeper. Pretty fish. On a piece of cut bait. Ain't that something? Huh. Having a good day, guys. Having a good day. Under here. I don't know how big he is. He feels like a pretty good one, yeah. I don't know yet. Yeah, I need yeah, to nail bacon. Awesome. Here, I'll take that fatty right there. That's a good one. You don't catch him off that same bait. Yeah. I know, I change colors. I, it ain't the same. It's the, it's not the, the pearl. Uh, I don't know what the heck it was called. I hope I can get my lead head back out of his mouth. That one's definitely we good. Oh, we got a good one on. Oh, I got to tighten my drag up. Yeah, give me the net. This feels like a pretty good drum here. Oh, God, he's pulling. He's not a huge one, but he's a good one. He kind of give up on me.
I've been keeping a big rod out for these big red drum in these ponds down here. Oh, we caught some pretty, pretty good ones today. That one, we had a 29 and a half this morning. That one's every bit of 28, probably. Pretty fish. Yeah, buddy. Whew. 